Finally, there are two left standing. The Bayonne Bees used their high-flying attack to Pepper Summit and claimed the public title. And Hudson Catholic, they had 35 saves from goalie Joe Alicio to upset the defending state champion Seton Hall Prep and gain the world field title. Tonight, a new state champion will be crowned. in East Rutherford, New Jersey, CNA Sports presents the New Jersey Devils NJSIAA State Ice Hockey Championship. Tonight, it's the overall championship game as the public champ, the Bayonne Bees, take on the parochial champion in the Hawks from Hudson Catholic. Hello again, everybody. I'm Mick Mottinghoff, once again, joined by Pete Caggiano, as we are set to find out who has the number one ice hockey team in the state here tonight. Now, Pete, this is the 25th year of this tournament, and yet for tonight, these two teams are playing for their first ever overall championship. Absolutely, Mick. In fact, we will crown a new champion tonight because both Steen Hall and Brick were eliminated in earlier rounds. But the two teams here tonight, Hudson Catholic Bayonne, they earned the right to play. Sort of like a neighborhood rivalry. The schools are only a few miles apart. In fact, there's three players on the Hudson Catholic team that live in Bayonne. Well, let's talk about Bayonne. Here is a team that has really turned up the scoring punch. That was evident in their 6-3 win in the, pro in the public final over Summit. Well, they're playing very well. They're cruising right now in the playoffs. In their five playoff games so far, they've outscored their opponents by a margin of 27 to 8. And they're led by Dave Botson. He is the unstoppable force. Two goals and three assists in that 6-3 win over Summit. Botson's playing very, very well. As you mentioned, two goals and three assists the other night. Ten points in his last two games. And he does such a great job going to the net. And as we mentioned, he knows how to celebrate. Well, no doubt about that. But tonight... Bayonne takes on a very talented Hudson Catholic team. All they did to get here to this overall championship game was knock off the parochial champ, the defending champ, and also the defending overall champ in Seton Hall Prep. Wow, they played a great game the other night. Hard fought, two to one victory. They capitalized on their chances, and they played great defense. And no doubt about it, but the key is the guy in goal, and that's the immovable object, Joe Alicio, 35 saves in that win against the Prep. Joe was tremendous in that game. Stop 35 of 36 shots, and he does it all. In fact, in the three playoff games, he's only allowed three goals. That's just one goal per game. And he does it using the stick, using the legs. He's done a fine job. Well, Pete, like you said, this may be like a county championship, but it's for the overall state championship. And we'll find out who has the number one team in the state when we come back in a moment as Hudson Catholic takes on Bayonne. Stay with us right here on CNA.